All right. So I looked up what the Thornlet did, because that's the item that I chose to ignore in the previous room, the previous chest before the save point. It turns out that the Thornlet is the best helmet in the game at the cost of putting you in the sap status. So I don't know if I would really like that or not, but that's what it is, and that's for you to know, okay, but it's not for me. Not now, because I'm totally spent. My ninja is a useless mage right now. Okay, climb the stairs and make a left on the next floor. Hmm. A lot of chests with monsters in them. Uh, my problem being that I'm totally spent. Preemptive attack. See preemptive escape. I don't know this guy. He could be a goon for all I know. Let me use one last cure two on my ninja here. Now the previous time these enemies were didn't do much. So I guess I could guess I could be a little aggressive here. Ah uh, hell no. That's false advertisement. Knew it. When I saw this chick with the hookah. Oh, uh, and this is one of those fights. This is one of those fights. Where it takes forever to escape, and by that time, they'll wipe out your whole party. Even if it's like... Weak ass level one goblins. This is the blow right now. Yo, I'm gonna heal him. Fuck that shit. Fuck you and your rules. You are kidding me right now. Damn. Who is Wallen? Now there aren't many fights in this game that make me go chill. The ones that do make me go like that are the ones where I'm trying to escape. It's a battle where you can run from it, but something is stopping you. Now, there are some games that don't give you any drama for this kind of shit, like Chrono Cross and Final Fantasy X, for that matter. But here, it's like you're really supposed to... They want the idea of a random battle to be... One of a gamble, really.
And this bitch again? I'm gonna hold this. You're like, fuck you, bitch, I'm gonna run. Say like motherfuckers know I got really low willpower. I pretty soon I'll give in and actually try to fight this guy, but for now I ain't got no respect for these guys. Come on, let's make it out of here. Is it that I can't escape? Well, why can't you just write, like, can't run, like... Nice. Nice. We got out of that one. I'm pleased. With... Oh, my bad. Oh, wow. I didn't even know that about them. Shit. I'm getting the fuck out. I don't know if I can even take on the next boss, which... That's not a reassuring thing to think about being this deep into a dungeon. Knew it when I saw a little chamber, a little sh shoot. I knew some motherfuckers would pop out of that. Both containing monsters. The one on the left has a dark matter. The one on the right has a crystal mail. Actually, the boss isn't in this temple. So knowing that I'm going to really indulge my sadistic side... They really, when they do that, that also kind of gets me a little tight. Uh, take it easy, son. Titan. And they ain't got no Phoenix down, boy? That's fucked up, man.
Well, at least let me check some of the items that I've gotten from this area. Shit. Shit. Airblade. Excalibur. Gotta be a better way. Hmm. Okay, white. Hmm. Now I gotta really think this through. Right, there's a crystal mail. Alright. I got my plan right here. Okay, um... White. Good enough. Wait, what? And you give me that? That's fucked up. You give me that ring? Well, I can always unequip it when it's my turn next, but... That's fucked up, man. All right, one more. Come on, get it in. Ooh. That was really lucky. Okay. Here's the Mystic Knight. Let's put him back on that with this. I fucked him for trying to give me that. Put her back in the path of righteousness as a... Hmm. It's a white mage. Except you can give her this instead of summons, since she has no MP left anyway. And you can have 
They keep the ninja. I didn't mean for this when I set up my healing session, but of course, they're going to equip me with the shitty stuff. Okay, first let me switch this out with the slumber. And then, well, that's as much as I can switch out right now. You replace this with uh, some Genji gloves. And a Genji helmet and... Ah, oh, come on. This is the only way I can get some healing going. Don't do this to me, man. Alright. This place has put hatred into my heart. I'll never be the same after this. Preemptive attack. This was the best strategy I had going for me. Now everyone's above 500. This is the struggle right here, man. Alright. Right, right, right. I'm sounding like Diddy now. When you reach the bottom, keep going down to find a secret path. Oh, I was going left when I meant to go down. This shit is tricky. See, there's a treasure chest over there, but there's also monsters. Heal butts first, cause he has that 4K HP. You know what I could use right now? I could use a bard, actually. Okay, second one from the left contains mods. Fall down the first one on purpose and examine the chest to battle monsters and find a dark matter. We're not going to be doing that right now.
We're also definitely not going to be doing this. Multiple enemies? Hell no. Press left. Head back to main path. Press left one to move the wall back. All right. So there's some secrets there, but those secrets have monsters. Shit, you know what we about to do. We about to ignore all that. This place has put hatred into my heart, so you best believe I'm gonna go back here if I can. I'm going to smash through everyone. We're in the last paragraph finally. The chess contains monsters and earth. Okay. What does this chest contain? Does this one contain a trap? Let me see. Yup, it contains a trap. Rest assured they all do. Okay, focus on her. He's actually going kind of well. I'm surprised. This was what I was expecting. However...
Come on, get that turn in, Ferris. You're our only hope right now. Alright, finish him off, butts. That's fire right there. Well, at least we got a, an earth hammer. steps from the right. Now there is a path that can lead you to 10,000 gold, but I want to stay uninvolved as much as I can. I could have been involved with that and been fine. All right. She. Now I'm being way too cautious. Preemptive attack, preemptive escape. I know. Oh, I remember these guys. These guys are bitches. I'm holding on to three buttons at once. Ah, fuck. No, he's about to do some shit. Come on, let's get out of here. You might be saying, well, that's not so bad. Well, you got to understand, these guys may have, like, some endgame level attacks. Like, previous time where he got hit with flare level 3. And I don't want to get involved with that. Okay, let me see. See, that stays the same.
There's the one in the middle half. There's a chest on the right have. Besides my impending doom. Oh, ten thousand gil. Even better. Now what does this contain? Oh, an elixir. Well, we'll need that, certainly. In fact, who can use that right now? I don't know. Climb to previous two chests, you'll find an elixir on the left corner. Why'd I do that? Not this girl again. Hell yeah, we got out of there. As we should. Okay, kill yourself. Oh, she's in her 800s in this form. That's good. Already, as a white mage, she's level 4. That's good. We got a long ways to go with Ferris. And we're almost done with butts in this regard.
Okay, four chests. I'm assuming we're near the end. Two chests. Yeah, you guys be fucking around with me. But at long last, we're finally done with this area. Obtain first tablet. And a decent track. What was that? There was writing on the tablet. The King Bahamut. So an entire continent sunk down. That's some Kafka shit. The peninsula is sinking? A. It's the legend himself. Stand guard. There's no way we'd be able to take on Bahama now, even if I was in good condition. I'll be waiting for you on the North Mountain. Hell yeah, Bahamut's a badass. He's like, yeah, I ain't ready for this. Come back when you tough. Look, the airship's being washed this way. Well, I guess we're home free now. We could always go back to get the missing items and shit. <sighs> guess I opened a new save file for nothing. But no big, you're supposed to be careful with these shits. Hmm. Let me go through it this way. Now in this game you never get healed for shit. No matter what the occasion is. Check. We turn her into a black mage. Let me turn this motherfucker into a black mage as well.
And lastly, I'll turn you into a samurai. All right. Now we're moving on our own, so shit's about to get real. It's to hear you. And we got Lena back. Oh yeah. I'm about to fuck some shit up tonight. Lena, wake up. And we went through a whole... This body is mine. We went through a whole, like, dungeon without her and it was difficult as shit. Go, Mara Jean. You're finally free from the cleft of dimension after a thousand years. x -Def. These are like x -Def's, like, prison buddies. <laughs> the monster of the cleft dimension have all become my minions. Monsters of cleft dimension. Plural. Let us stop, please. How nice. Being killed at the hands of your own. Before you, I think I'm going to get rid of that turtle. You better chill with all that fresh shit. Soon, this power will be completely mine, and the world will be brought to its knees. L Lena, stop! Here you attack in desperation. Lena's body was separated from the monster. Hey, she kind of my type. Now, you know, she really is white. Image, you know, let's just use Fire Three. Guild toss. That sucked. Now this is a barrier change boss. But she's also obscenely slow, which will come in our favor. Lena, but I, Lena, sister Kara, the castle, I was surrounded in total darkness. We understand. Try not to speak. There's no like hype music when she joined. For those of you who can't hear. Oh, she out.
Well, I'm about to run my ass back. Okay. Anyway. Now, are there any shops around here? Because Lord knows we need some stuff right now. It's the end. The world has no hope. It's just a bunch of demoralized assholes. That sucks. Well, the good news is that we're no longer in that difficult predicament. We did lose $5,000 for no reason, though. I'm a little annoyed by that. Gugnir. Hmm. Drain break by a image shell heal. Okay, we already got all of this. Yeah, items here are a little behind. Yeah, when we, when I have my next recording session, we'll pretty much plow through the previous dungeon as I'm determined to get my vengeance. Now, whenever a dungeon or an enemy gives me a difficult time, it's customary for me to want payback. This is obvious. I mean... I don't want to look like a damn fool all the time. And it's of my best interest to really show that dungeon what's boss, that temple. And I'll do that tomorrow. I'll put it off until then. As usual, this has been Mr. Wonka 7. And suck my dick.